I'm Danielle Kern Camp. Here's what's making headlines in Kern County this Tuesday morning. About 1,500 votes still need to be counted in the last uncalled congressional race in the country. TJ Cox is already claiming victory over incumbent David Valadeo. Hey everyone, uh, so excited to be here in Washington, D.C. at new member orientation. Uh, happy to get to work for the people of the Central Valley. Uh, we just got our new office today, and let me reiterate, that's not my office, that's your office. Right after we're sworn in January 3rd, please come see us. That video was released by Cox on Twitter. Cox spent last week in Washington attending new member orientation. The race between Cox and Valadeo has been close for weeks, but according to the California Secretary of State's website, Cox has a lead of 820 votes. Kern, Kings, and Fresno counties are all reporting that outstanding ballots have been counted. However, about 1,500 votes remain uncounted in Tulare. Bakersfield College is receiving a $115,000 grant. The money will reportedly enable BC to increase outreach strategies, student support resources, and more leadership opportunities for Dreamers. BC is one of 32 college campuses who's receiving $115,000 in support from the funds. And Reading Cinemas is bringing a holiday favorite to the big screen and also inviting the community to watch in their PJs. The Polar Express pajama party is happening this Saturday morning at 10 a.m. Holiday cookies and hot cocoa will be sold. Tickets are just $6 a piece and can be purchased on the Reading Cinemas app at the box office or online. Reading Cinemas is located on Weibel Road. Now let's get a quick check of your Tuesday forecast with Josh. Well, your Tuesday weather headlines involve a mountain wind advisory until 8 p.m. for those mountain communities until 8 p.m. Tuesday tonight. Rain and snow chances overnight uh, through uh, Thursday as well and scattered showers also through Thursday. Air quality at that moderate range and AQI of 53. We'll be in those lower 60s for our highs over the next three uh, days into the weekend as well. Lows going to be in those 40s. Chance of showers tonight start around 40% chance tonight into tomorrow and then about a 10% chance you can see some showers for that Christmas parade on Thursday. For the Kern River Valley, breezy conditions as well take us into the midweek. A high of 56, low of 41. The Hatchby could see some snow starting tonight. A high of 49, low is going to be in those 30s. Fraser Park also a chance of snow. High of 47, low of 34. Josh, thank you. That's going to do it for this update. Enjoy your Tuesday.